Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mode. Happy to see you here. Really interesting problem today. We need to simplify this. We have square root of 11 minus 4 square root of 7. On the first side, this problem is real hard because we have square root, moreover, we have square root inside, or moreover, square root of 7, which is not good. This is not our table case. 11 is not good. This is a prime number. So it's on the first side, this problem is real hard. But I want to show you a really good approach. How can we simplify this? First of all, let's write this 4 as 2 times 2, okay? let's do this. We'll have 11 minus 2 times 2 and times square root of 7. Okay, we just write it as 2 times 2. Next step, I suggest you to write this 11 as 4 plus 7. Why I write this? Because I'm going to show you a really good trick later. So this 11 I write is as 4, then I write this minus 2 times 2 times square root of 7 and plus 7 in the end. So this is our 11, 4 plus 7. Why I write this? Because if we look closely to this expression, I, on the bottom of this I write this formula a square minus 2ab and plus b square, which is equal to a minus b. This is our school identity, we all know this formula, but why I write this formula right here? Because if we look closely, we have 2 right here, we have 2 right here. We have 2 right here, and if we write this a square as 2 square, so if we write this in that way, so we have 2 square, so I just rewrite this 4 as, as 2 square, so 2 square minus 2 times 2 times square root of 7, and I want to write this 7 as plus square root of 7 square. So this is the same 7 as right here, but I write it in this way. And take a look closely, what do we have right now? We have a square, we have a square, we have a right here, we have 2, we have b, and we have b square. So it looks like this is our case. This is our, our formula. So let's write it. This is equal to a minus b square. So a equal to 2 minus a minus b square, which is equal, of course, and we write it as 2 minus square root of 7 square. This is our formula. And right now I'm going to plug in this expression to the our question in the beginning. So this expression we can change a square root of 2 minus square root of 7 square. And if we plug in all of this, what we'll have? We can easily cancel our, our square root and our square sign. Okay? And if we cancel this, this is equal to absolute value 2 minus square root of 7. Why write this absolute value? Because we need to find the sign of this inside this square root sign. On the first side, this is positive 1, but if you look closely, square root of 7 is greater than 2, because square root of square root of 4 equal to 2. And right here we have square root of 7, so this is greater than this. So we need to put minus behind these parentheses and 2 minus square root of 7. And if you open our parentheses, we will have our final answer, square root of 7 minus 2. This is our, our final answer. A little bit complicated problem, but I hope you understand this explanation. If you don't understand, write your question in comment. I help everyone. If it's not hard to you, leave a like, write any comment. You helps to improve my video and to improve my channel. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos. Thank you for your support.